What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going over something that just may be extremely exciting for Predator Hunting Grounds. As many of you may know, the Arnold Sports Festival happened this past weekend in Columbus, Ohio. Speaking of which, shout out to Half Thor. The boy's done it again. Dude's a freak in nature. Excited to see what's next for him. But, one thing that's always exciting about the Arnold Sports Festival is the fact that Arnold Schwarzenegger is there, of course, representing all the athletes and doing interviews throughout the whole weekend. And during one of his interviews, he was asked whether or not he watches his movies when they come on on television. And uh, he actually had a pretty interesting response that may have unintentionally leaked something that has not been confirmed yet. He said, the other day Predator came on and I said to my girlfriend, let's watch the beginning. And we ended up watching the whole thing because it's still held up today. Other movies don't hold up, but movies like Predator and the first Terminator really do, and it was really fun to watch. Interesting enough, a week later I was asked to do some voiceover for a video game that is coming out about Predator. So it was great that I watched it to get back in that mood again to do the voiceover. Now while Arnold does not say Predator Hunting Grounds here, and technically, yeah, there could be another Predator game out there that Arnold is doing a voiceover, sure. The odds of that though, extremely slim, let's be realistic here, let's think about it. Predator Hunting Grounds, the only Predator game we're hearing about, it's the big one, it's the AAA one, it's fully being ran by Sony and Warner Brothers, I mean, it's it's the one that Arnold should be a part of. So I would not be surprised at all, but like I said, it was never confirmed, nor was it talked about by Belfarmic, No, it was talked about by Sony at all. I imagine it's supposed to be a big surprise that Arnold may have unintentionally uh, dropped, the, <laughs> dropped the bomb there. Um, but regardless, I'm super excited. I think, one, there's potential here now that there's actually an Arnold character in the game, which would be great. I mean, when you think of Predator, you think of Arnold. It's as simple as that. So to have him involved, I think, was not just a great thing for the game, but essential to making it truly an overall Predator game. And not only that, but there's now there's potential for more and more characters to come back, other Predator alumni, to be characters within the game. Although... I'm assuming just to save Arnold's time and, you know, not have a ton of money, you know, not to spend a ton of money on Arnold, I'm assuming that he might just be doing some basic voiceover work, maybe like the voice in the tutorials, the voice opening the game, maybe some radio uh, voice that's coming through the soldier's ears during gameplay, things like that. I'm not so sure it's for an actual character, but it could be, and I hope it is. And hopefully it leads to that. There's a lot of exciting things that can happen within the Predator Hunting Grounds game. And we'll be all over that thing. We'll be a part of the trial thing. We'll give you everything you know about Predator. We'll be right here. We'll be on top of it. And that's really start about to start hitting the channel heavily in the next week or so. So just get ready for that. Predator Hunting Grounds, extremely excited for it. But hey, let me know your thoughts about this. Do you think Arnold is actually going to be a part of the game? Let me know what you think in the comments below. But that's going to wrap up today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. And if you really enjoy what you're seeing, consider becoming a member for just $2 by clicking the link in the description below. And of course, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you next time.